Welcome everybody uh, to the planting of a cherry tree uh, which symbolizes the relationship between Portland and Shinagawa, Japan. This is a 30-year sister city relationship and thanks to the vision of our mayor uh, and we are grateful uh, to Portland uh, Parks for uh, this wonderful cherry tree which is planted here in uh, Tommy's, uh, well actually uh, Post Office Plaza and uh, hopefully as this cherry tree continues to grow the relationship with Portland and Shinagawa will mirror that and continue to grow as well and we're very honored uh, to be part of this uh, tree planting ceremony. To uh, to make this uh, this cycle come to fruition, uh, we'll start by having our uh, original mayor, when I say original mayor, back in 1984, uh, David Brennerman was mayor of Portland and he signed the original sister city relationship uh, into being and uh, as a result, uh, the fruits of his vision and the vision of uh, Shinagawa Mayor Aitura Taga uh, have come uh, full circle and so uh, without further ado I'd like to welcome David Brennerman uh, the mayor who signed the sister city relationship uh, into being 30 years ago. Thanks Jeff. Uh, when we signed the sister city uh, relationship 30 years ago, I, I, as, as Jeff said, I had the great honor and fortune to be mayor of Portland. And we commenced the relationship because in some small way, we wanted to contribute to world peace and understanding. And as many of uh, us have been to Japan and a number of Japanese uh, citizens have been to Portland of all different uh, walks of life, uh, I think that we've had greater understanding of each other and Mayor Brennan was able to uh, lead a delegation to celebrate the 30th anniversary. A number of uh, former mayors have been to Shinagawa and of course mayors of Shinagawa have been here as well as other uh, citizens, uh, children, uh, people of different professions. And so it is uh, a great thing that we are uh, dedicating this uh, planting of a tree today and I want to introduce Mayor Michael Brennan uh, to continue this uh, tradition and uh, say a few words. Mayor Brennan. <clears throat> Thank you, former Mayor Brennan. <laughs> and uh, what I'd like to do is invite up the former city manager Joe Gray and former Mayor Ann Pringle and um, we're going to do a toast. So, and to Mayor Habano, uh, who hopefully will get to see this in, uh, Jeff? Yep, we'll come on up. Okay. So, uh, this is, uh, uh, thank you for the 30 year uh, uh, sister city relationship that we've had with Shinagawa and Portland. And this is uh, a toast in recognition of that 30 year anniversary and continued of many years of uh, goodwill, peace, and friendship uh, between our two cities. Here, here. We should mention uh, that this is cherry juice in keeping with the cherry uh, tree behind us. And uh, Joe, would you hold this for a second? We would like to, on behalf of friends of Shinagawa, present uh, Mayor Brennan with a Portland Shinagawa t-shirt. <laughs> and this, uh, this is uh, our thanks for the mayor's vision and the mayor's uh, uh, actions to continue this relationship that has benefited the citizens of both Portland and Shinagawa all these years. So on behalf of Friends of Shinagawa, uh, Mr. Mayor Brennan, enjoy. Well, well, thank you very much. I appreciate it, <laughs> Jeff. And I accept it on behalf of all everybody that went on the uh, trip to Shinagawa, the delegation. Uh, it was a terrific group of people and we all got along well uh, <laughs> for extended periods of time that we spent with each other. And uh, what I'd like to say just very quickly, when I was in Shinagawa and I spoke, I talked about the importance of planting this cherry tree 
uh, symbolizing our friendship and continued relationship with the city of Shinagawa. And I noted the fact that uh, it was my hope that my granddaughter would be able to come and see the cherry tree and to understand that even though she hadn't been to Japan yet, that we had all gone to visit. Yes, Ariza. <laughs> and recognize that she had friends throughout the world as a result um, of the first relationship that David established back in 1984. And I, I just recently uh, came across the saying, and I thought this was great and very apropos for today. But they said the, the sign of a civilized society is when older people plant trees knowing they will never sit in the shade of those trees. So I hope every one of us has the opportunity to sit in the shade of this tree. <laughs> but I also hope that many generations and many people of all ages will come and benefit from the shade of this tree. Daniela, thank you for bringing Ariza today. We appreciate it. Daniela is a biologist, so she really understands the importance of, uh, of trees. But very quickly, Jeff, I'd like you to come up and explain a little bit more about the history of the tree as well as what you just mentioned about the Four River and... Yeah, sure. Thank you. Uh, Thank you. I'm Jeff Tarling, the city arborist in Portland. And uh, Post Office Park has a long history of a lot of effort from the community to become a park. In 1992, a committee was formed. Uh, we talked about design attributes and really thought about the sister city program and that this brickway that you're walking on or standing on represents the four river flowing down to the islands of Casco Bay. The Japanese mailboxes, the antique mailboxes have been a, uh, a real focal point of this park. I know uh, former mayor Esther Clenet always reminded me of how important it was to have the right color so we want to make sure that the, the mailboxes look good. But the cherry tree that we're planting today is a sergeant cherry. Uh, it's, a, it's a cultivar called Accolade and cherry trees in Portland in the early 90s, we only had a few down on Commercial Street, and we saw how well they did and what it did for people's spirit in the spring when they bloom. And so we've prospered that idea and continued to plant trees throughout the Eastern Prom, Western Prom, and throughout the city. There's four cherry trees in front of City Hall. And I think that spring spirit that it brings and the happiness is a real tribute to the type of tree that we picked out today. So next spring, we may not have shade, but we'll have, we'll have cherry blossoms to come and enjoy. <laughs> So thank you for coming today. That's great for having me involved. Jeff, thank you very yes. much. And Jeff put this together very quickly, so we really appreciate it. And uh, Ann Pringle wanted me to just make note very quickly that uh, we obviously are looking for any students or young people that would want to participate in the exchange. Is it next year? Next summer. Ne next summer. So uh, if you know of anybody, uh, recruitment is on, and it's a, a terrific uh, uh, event and opportunity for young people to go to Japan. So does anybody else want to say anything? Well, if not, thank you very much and thanks uh, for being here. Good morning, Mayor Hamano. This is Mayor Brennan uh, from Portland, Maine. And we're standing here with uh, Jeff Sandler from Shin Friends of Shinagawa. And we just planted a Japanese cherry blossom tree in Post Office Park in honor of our 30 year anniversary sister city relationship with your great city. And this is my granddaughter who helped uh, plant the tree. So we just wanted to say hello to you. Thank you for the wonderful visit uh, in April that we had to Japan. And this uh, fulfills the promise we made to plant a cherry tree in honor of uh, the relationship that we have again with your wonderful city. And so I'm gonna turn it over to Jeff Sandler. Thank you, Mayor Hamano, once again for your vision and support of this relationship that has continued and benefited the citizens of both Portland and Shinagawa all these years. And whenever we look at this uh, cherry tree here in our post office park, we will think of the warmth and the gracious hosting that you have always extended to all Portland citizens whenever we have had the privilege to come to your wonderful city. So. From all of us here in Portland, Maine, domo arigato gozaimashita.